Hi guys, I am playing the Rewind event in Toilet Tower Defense. I recently completed all the tiers of the event and got the Scientist Clockman. This is an interesting unit that combines income with a strong barrier. As to the income, it goes to 1,500, which is a bit less than the Santa unit. But when it comes to the barrier, it goes to 600,000, which is pretty strong relative to the Scientist TV Man. It is even stronger than the Black Lucky Block of the Titan Clover. I first thought of using this unit in endless mode, but it has one big flaw. It cannot be sold. In endless mode, it is very important to have the ability to sell the money units later in the game. So I decided to do the rewind insane level instead. You also cannot place more than three scientist clockmen on the map, so I would need to use another unit. I am choosing the really cheap but good toxic titan. You can get it in the trading plaza for like 25 gems or sometimes even less. So let's start. Now, one thing I do not like about the new Scientist Clockman is that it costs 500 to place it. This is relative to 200 of placement cost for the old Scientist TV Man Barrier and the Santa unit. It is really hard to find $500 at the start of the game, so I had to put the game on auto skip and wait all the way until wave four to place the first one. I even had to let a few of the toilets go to the base. No big harm was done, but still a bit annoying. I also had to wait until wave six to place the second scientist and until wave eight to place the third one. I then continued to upgrade my three scientists. The upgrade cost is not cheap, so it took me quite a few more waves. The last upgrade of the Scientist Clockman is truly expensive at 15,000. This is compared to the last upgrade of the Scientist TV Man, which is only 6,000. But then the barrier becomes really strong at 600,000. However, it seems there are some parasite toilets that can cross the barrier unharmed, which could prove deadly if you do not have a unit shooting those parasites after the cross. The Scientist Clockman carried me all the way to wave 26 in insane mode, which is really impressive. Now it's time to start placing some Toxic Titans. I am also throwing in a Medic to protect the Titans from stunning and increase their efficiency. You can get the Medic for very few gems or summon it with coins. To cut the story short, I am now in wave 49 with six max toxic titans. They do not even let the toilets get to the first corner. The scientist clockmen at this point are purely income units. Well, insane mode does not really seem that insane. Seemed pretty easy to me. I did it all in auto skip with placing only nine units on the map. And other than the scientist clockman, I only use cheap units. If you like this video, please leave a like and subscribe. Do it now. Are you doing it? Thanks. You can also watch my next video by pressing the thumbnail at the top left of the screen. See you in my next video.